Hey miners, uh, today I have a video for you. Um, it's uh, it's not a long one. I'm gonna make a I'm gonna make a quick video on what I did with my uh, start bat file um, on my six card Ethereum mining rig. Um, basically, um, I'm gonna I'm I'm tapping into my uh, my miner upstairs right now using TeamViewer, so um, it's actually uh, changing the hash rates a bit. Um, because I'm using uh, one of the cards here to uh, to view the screen here. Um, but anyways, um, here's what it looks like. Um, it's currently um about thirty mega hashes uh, per card. Uh, there's a couple at twenty nine. This one here is obviously uh, it's got video output, so it's a bit low uh, right now because um while well, I'm using it. Um, but anyways, um these hash rates are nice and stable. Um, the temperature, as you can see here, is low. Um, we were talking 61, 61, um, 57, you know, this one's a bit high, 67. This is actually my, uh, the hottest card I have. Um, but the rest are high 50s, low 60s. Um, uh, I'm not using MSI Afterburner. I'm only using it to adjust the fan speed, but all my clock timings are, are in the bat file. Um, anyways, so uh, let me show you the bat file. So here's my bat file. Um, I set the environment variables up top here. Um, you just gotta make sure you put set X before the actual variable. Um, the first portion is the miner. Then I got my pool. Um, then I got my wallet address. Password I have at X. Watchdogs at one. ESM zero, that's a stratum. Uh, mode one, I'm only mining one coin, that's Ethereum. Um, that is a that plays a, a very important role in this. Um, don't bother mining two coins. Uh, it's a waste of energy, and uh, basically it's a waste of time. Um, <clears throat> Ethereum. I have the intensity set at eight. Etha is um, the card optimization. Um, I have it at zero, which is for faster cards. All coins one. It's pretty much a standard. Uh, input here uh, I don't really see the point of having I kept it in there you can take it off see see what happens uh, but anyways I have my temperature stop at 85 fan minimum at 80 um, core clock is at 1130 this is what I was talking about I was putting uh, my memory clock and voltage in the bat file itself uh, memory clock 2200 core voltage 960 memory voltage 960 um, and with that, I usually put pause at the end, just in case there's a an error. Uh, it pauses, and, and I, I can see what it failed on. Um, but with that, you know, you're uh, you're left with um, we're left with stable hash rates on every card. Um, you know, I'm I'm mining at 180 total total hash rate 180 179. My total shares have uh, have gone up, but probably almost doubled by the end of the day. Um, the wattage at the wall, I knocked off 500 watts. Off my total, I was doing 1500 or 1450. Now I'm at 960, 980. Um, like I said, don't bother mining both coins. It, it's a waste of time and, and energy. It takes you forever to make any income off that. And when doing so, you're increasing um, the wattage uh, of the overall system you're increasing the temperature of the cards all my cards here are running low temps um, and um, it, it just takes you forever to gain any income from from mining two coins so your be best bet is to run just only only ethereum and I'm running the dual Eth claymore's dual ethereum miner um, it's it's the newest version. It does both Nvidia A and AMD cards, and um, that's about it. Um, here's uh, the MSI Afterburner. Here I only use it for um, to adjust the fan speed. But you, as you can see, um, the clock uh, the, the the CPU clock is set 11:30, and uh, the memory clock's at 2200. Uh, there's the voltage. There's the temp. Um, straightforward. Here's all the cards. And um, that's about it.
um, very straightforward stuff. Uh, made a huge difference for me. Hopefully, it makes it makes a difference for you guys. Um, if um, if this helps you out, like, subscribe if you will, and uh, pay it forward. Thanks for watching.